Hello friends, my name is Haley Hunt and I'm with Nye House Education Center. If you aren't familiar with Nye House, our mission is literacy success for all. We are here to give you some strategies so that all kids continue to learn and grow. Today we'll talk about what you can do with your kids after you read a book to them or after they read a book on their own. Think about what we call the five W questions. Who, what, when, where, and why. These questions will guide kids to think about what happens in a narrative text, that is, a text that is a story. Let's talk about these five W's. Who. This is who the story is about, the characters. Older students might discuss major and minor characters. What. This is when students think about the most important thing that happens in the story, or in other words, what happens that makes the story end the way it does. This part can be tricky for kids. They might need to retell the big events in the story to figure out the what. When and where. This is the setting. Setting includes time, which might be time of day, season, year, or time in history. And the where is the place or places the story takes place. Why. The why relates to the what. The why tells the most important thing in the story why it happened. You can discuss these questions with your kids out loud or have them write each of these five W questions on index cards or on sticky notes as I've done here, and they can physically move the cards as they answer questions, or you could write the, have them write the answers to the questions out on paper. The next step is to have your kids summarize the story using the five W questions. Basically, they will put their answers to the five W's in sentence form, and it might look something like this. The story is about who, it takes place when and where, what, because why. So for each of these sticky notes that I have on here, instead of saying who, when, where, what, why, they would give the answer that they discussed earlier. Don't feel limited to just answering the five W questions after a book. Kids who are reading chapter books can summarize each chapter using the five W questions. Children's could, children could also summarize TV shows and movies using this strategy. Make learning fun. Check back here for more strategies. Go to www.nighthouse.org to find out more about what we do or reach out to us at info at Take care, everyone.